In calculus, we often use derivatives to maximize or minimize functions on some interval a, b. And in this video, I want to give a quick tip that if you are given some function and you are asked to maximize this function, and you see that this function is concave up on this interval, then you don't actually need to compute any derivatives or look for critical points, because in this case, if you do have a critical point inside your interval, then it can only be a minimum. So all you need to do is just to compare the values of your function at the end points and choose the bigger one. So for example, here we are asked to maximize this quadratic function on the interval 0, 3. So we know that the graph of this function will be a parabola, and in this particular case, if you square things out, you can see that the coefficient in front of x squared will be 1 third plus 1 fifth. So it will be positive, which means that your parabola will be pointing upward, so it will be concave up. So we don't need to compute derivatives here, and if we just compare the values of this function at 0 and 3, we can see that the maximum will be 23 divided by 15, when x is equal to 3. 